Your Storm Shield forecast only on Fox 47 News. Well, Justin, we're another week into December. Yes, Any chance are. of some snow coming our way this week? Yeah, not during the work week, Gianni. It looks like the temperatures are going to be above normal for most of this seven day forecast until we get to the tail end. That's when things will start to turn a little bit. We'll talk about that tonight. Right now, temperatures are below freezing most places in mid-Michigan, including outside the Fox 47 studios where it's 30 degrees on a live look over I-496. No problems traffic-wise on 496 tonight. We do have temperatures that are into the mid and upper 30s today. Lansing at 37. Most other folks were in those middle 30s, a little bit lower. Jackson at 34. Same with Mason. We're still sitting close to the freezing mark. The places like Jackson and Charlotte who are just hanging on to those temps, including Adrian Ann Arbor, well, most other folks are down into the upper 20s or right around that 30 degree mark. The winds, though, the good news is that those are very calm, as you can see around the area, so not too much of a problem as far as the wind chills out there. Doppler radar has been quiet around here all day long, but it's not just the Great Lakes or mid Michigan. It's really everywhere in the country, except for portions of the Carolinas. A little bit of some lake effect snow came off of Lake Erie coming north to south today into Ohio and West Virginia. But other than that, it's just really a whole lot of nothing going on across the continental U.S. right now. So it's a quiet evening planner. Temperatures are going to be around 30 the next hour and then they start dropping into the 20s. We're partly cloudy for much of this overnight period. Eventually the low falls to about 24, 25 degrees. It's a little bit chilly, but fairly seasonable for this time of year. The wind will still be out of the northwest 5 to 10, but it's relatively light. It stays that way through the day tomorrow. You'll see future track all uh, the direction shifts. The winds will stay light tomorrow. We get into the morning, starts to cloud back up around the region, stays that way for much of the day. We'll see a few peaks of sun here and there. Maybe a very light Light stray snow flurry, but certainly nothing going to stick if anything does come out of this. There's very limited moisture to work with. We do see that by the evening skies are still fairly cloudy, but as we go into the overnight, things will start to eventually thin out closer to morning. Although we still start with most of the clouds Wednesday early, I think in the afternoon we start to thin out with plenty of sunshine as we get towards the end of our Wednesday. Something to look forward to. We'll also have milder air back in the picture. So our Tuesday here, we're close to normal, getting into the upper 30s around the region. You can see the skies are mainly cloudy through and through. Again, could see a stray flurry here or there, but certainly not going to mess with any sort of travel or anything else you got going on and nothing sticks. We're at about 38, 39 degrees for the high. It is a mainly cloudy day, a little bit gray, but we'll have more sun to work with the next several days. We're also going to be very dry for the next several days, at least until the weekend. That's when we have a greater chance for a storm system to move in that we're going to be watching closely. But right now it's looking like it's going to be mostly, if not entirely rain, at least until the tail end when we could see some snowflakes. But even then right now, no guarantee that any of that sticks. So we'll show you that here in the seven day again, 38 tomorrow, but we're up into the mid and upper forties for Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and conditions staying dry. I think late Wednesday and most of Thursday, very, very sunny. We'll start to get the clouds to come back in Friday ahead of some rain. Friday night probably is when the rain starts. Lingers into Saturday. We stay on the mild side, but it's a gray, more rainy day. Overnight, we continue to see the rain, and as the system gets towards its tail end by Sunday, we could see a few snow showers and flakes mixing in. Highs only around 34, so certainly could overnight, with the low being around 30, 31, see some snow, maybe in some areas stick, but that remains to be seen. We're seeing mainly rain for that system this weekend. Now, a thing to note this weekend after the weekend, I should say the tail end temperatures are back to around normal, if not a little below normal in the low to mid 30s after the mild stretch we're going to see to wrap up this work week. Just something to keep in mind as we go deeper into December.